Awesome. So what would you say is your definition of being an entrepreneur? I would say it would be taking something from nothing and uh, to escape velocity. So it's one thing to invent things. It's another thing to innovate at scale. And uh, that's the thing that I love doing. Yeah, and you've done that, taken something from nothing and made it into a huge business multiple times. Were you ever afraid to fail during this process? Oh, I think that's a big driver. You know, you're always afraid to fail. Um, and it's just, you know, the way I look at it, that you've got to follow your fear. Uh, you've got to jump in water over your head. And after a while, that's I, and I call it scary fun. It actually becomes addicting. <laughs> scary fun. Okay. What do you mean by that? Well, I mean, jumping in water over your head. You don't know if you're going to swim or not. You don't know uh, if there sometimes is a market, if your product's going to work, all, uh, you know, all of, the, all it's a of thrill. those things. It's a thrill. And why do you think it's necessary to follow your fear? Because that's when you learn the most. And uh, if it was easy, somebody would have done it before. You know, you look at uh, another company. I started Ariba. You know, it was just, we didn't even have a business plan. We just had uh, some people. And now 1.3 trillion uh, commerce goes through Ariba Network on an annual basis, which is more than Amazon, eBay, and Alibaba combined. So, uh, but in those early days, you just don't know. Wow. Okay. So if you could create a startup toolkit, what would be within it? It can be more tangible technology. It could be a personality trait you think every yep. entrepreneur needs to have. What would yep. be inside? Yep. Well, first of all, by far, number one is I believe the company with the best people wins. Now, uh, you have to give uh, that company, uh, those best people time in the business world, time equals money. So you've got to be able to raise some money. You've got to be able to uh, You've got to be able to fund it. But um, at the end of the day, I think in order to achieve escape velocity, you've got to build a high performance team. Mm 